Hi, my name is Christine Holanda. I'm the owner of Lily of the Valley Florist in La Quinta, California. I'm going to show you how to make corsages for the mothers of the bride and groom. That typically depends on their dress color, um, the color of the wedding, etc. When choosing the corsages for the mother of the bride or groom, um, it, it varies. Sometimes they like to do a um, traditional pin on or they would prefer to have a wrist corsage. There's various types of wrist corsages that you can, that you can get. There are very ornate um, and very simple. Um, so it really depends on the theme and kind of the feel that you're looking for for your corsage. Today we've chosen to use a very traditional red pin-on corsage. I'm going to start with a very traditional red rose. You take off all of the green because this will get cumbersome and get in, a, in your way. You also take off the outer petals which are called the guard petals. And then you begin by wrapping non-sticky floral tape around the base of the bloom and then you kind of find the spot that you think you want to move toward here which would be this and then you begin to add some accent flowers to that. Typically for a wedding you would use flowers that um, accentuate the uh, color scheme and theme for the wedding. And then you add some greens to fill in here. Wrap it again. With every stem that you add, you need to add a wrap. And then you want to add something down here because that's a little empty. And again, you wrap. Okay, now you have your basic look. So you kind of want to fill in to make it uh, complete. Um, so you want to add some more greens, maybe up here because that's a little sparse. Again, you hold it and you wrap it. And then I think we need something down here. Let's add some of this fill, which is misty. By the way, this is called Alstroemeria. And then hold it tight and wrap it to keep it in place. Now down here is very empty, so let's add just a bit more. How about a little greenery over there? And then you continue to wrap the stems all the way down. We're doing a pin-on corsage. If you were doing a wrist corsage, you would purchase the wrist lit band at any craft store and attach this to that portion. You're going to cut the stems at that point and then you're going to make a bow. You take the bow and you put it very tightly up against the bottom of the blooms. You crisscross the back to secure the bow. You do the final tie, bring it up tight under the bow to secure it. Tighten in a knot, and then you just add pins to the back. This is how you make a corsage for the mother of the bride or groom.